Yo, what's up everyone? It's Paulie. How's your week going, okay? So I guess where I last left off with everyone was Friday, um, where I had uh, a flat battery at 3.45 in the afternoon. Um, that was definitely exciting. Um, I ended up getting the wrong battery. Super cheap or it closed and I had to go back the next morning. I'd, uh, I'd, I was lucky enough to have Bryce come pick me up from the, uh, from the car so I didn't have to catch another Uber which was fantastic. Thank you Bryce. And uh, the next morning got a battery, um, took an Uber to super cheap, no, I was able to get the car started. That's right, Bryce was able to help me charge the battery. So thank you again, Bryce. That's right, we got the uh, battery charged, got the uh, car home, got it there the next day, and uh, swapped the batteries over, got the right one, and headed down for our snorkeling adventure down in, uh, what was it, uh, the Omeo. I, I keep calling it the Oreo, just because it sounds tasty. But um, the Omeo shipwreck, which is just south of south south of Perth. Thank you, Scott, for that suggestion. Um, and yeah, those guys went for a scuba dive around the shipwreck there while uh, while I filmed. I had the the DS, uh, the mirrorless set up on a tripod. Um, I had the aerial unit uh, in place, and uh, they also had a GoPro which I sent with them. So that was. Um, that got some really good footage as well. The water wasn't the clearest, but uh, it was still uh, uh, clear enough to get some decent images out of it. Big shout out to Scott Parent on that one, and uh, also Bryce Talis. Thank you once again, gentlemen. Uh, it was Scott's idea to actually go, um, and that was a uh, fantastic uh, adventure to go on. Um, and that was just as uh, regulations had been eased by the, uh, the Prime Minister, so that was fantastic. Um, apart from that, we did, I did some filming with uh, Coach Morley, which I've still got uh, the editing to do. I had to put that off, I think, Friday, do it at Saturday or Sunday morning, or I did it Thursday morning, and yes, yeah, so I'm still behind. I've still got to edit that, and uh, I'm currently editing a webinar for um, uh, for someone so uh, I'm just getting that into the uh, into the editor now I've got uh, some highlights here for control Barkley a uh, NBA rec draft recruit I believe uh, I'm not sure which league he's playing for but um, oh, where did that go but uh, yes, I'm, uh, I'm fortunate enough to be editing his... Uh... Oh, I tried to the wrong one. Uh, so I've just realised I've got the wrong overlay. There we go. Uh, so I'm editing some of his footage. Uh, I've also got uh, a player from UBL uh, that I'm editing the footage for. Uh, I've still got a couple of other projects there that are backed up from the AUBA and uh, other basketball players that I'm getting to. And this week has been exciting. Uh, this week... Because everything's starting to come back online now, I've been fortunate enough to be contacted by some of my previous uh, uh, customers and clients and to know that they've been able to survive the last three months, um, it's exciting. It's, I'm thrilled for them that they've been able to pull through it because a lot of people haven't been able to. A lot of small businesses have closed. Um, but once again, I've been fortunate enough that all my clients are still, still okay. Um, well, I mean, I don't know that for sure, but I'm, I'm going there to start to take photos. So, I mean, it's, uh, it's good to see them coming back, though, and I'm, I'm going to do anything I can to help. Um, you know, my services are going to be free for them for the, for the first visit, at least, because, I mean, it's, uh, it's the last expense they need in a long list of other expenses. And, you know, often, if, as a creator, you do really good work, you'll find you'll get work because of work. So I mean, if, if you're willing to do a free job here or there, you'll get, you'll get it. Some people find this hard to believe, but I get it in tenfold. Um, I've, uh, it's happened a number of times. Uh, Full Core Fitness, let me explain that one, for example. Um, because of that one filming opportunity, I've gotten 
paid gigs for functions uh, with Build Core, um, filming jobs with SBL teams, uh, other leagues. Um, it's the list goes on and on, really. Um, and that was just from that one. Um, so some creators will tell you not to do free work, and here's the thing: I don't think. The, I think the way they're trying to phrase it is value what you make give it some value um, because if you are making some decent quality content then it is bringing some value but obviously if you enjoy what you do don't let money be the, the end point and the stickler for why you do it um, it will work itself out eventually uh, at first I wasn't making any money as a credit I was terrible um, I was embarrassed to ask people for money actually so <laughs> when I finally did get a paid job it was um, one it was confidence building but two it uh, it was reassuring and, and gave me the, as I said confidence building reassuring also helped me uh, teach me the process of um, of doing that and sort of asking money for your work because as, as a artist or creator you don't off, you're not obviously trained all the time or you don't often have the training or it's not obviously explained how to uh, uh, conduct business so that slow start off was great um, sorry I've just sent a message Scott's got an issue with his computer uh, let me uh, I call you can you call me tomorrow sorry guys just give me one second I've got a Scott Sorry, Scott's uh, a fantastic guy. I met him a couple of years ago uh, on some of our other adventures, and he's been in South America for the past year. Um, first time we saw him on the uh, on the scuba diving adventure, and it was fantastic to see him. Um, he's a very adventurous spirit. He's uh, someone that he doesn't take unnecessary risks, but he's willing to get out of his comfort zone. Um, and I also like, he's got a positive attitude, he's good fun to be around. Um, he mixes, Bryce and, I mean, Bryce gets along with anyone, Bryce is fantastic, but uh, him and Bryce get along really well. Um, so to see those two be able to, getting the rapport that those two have on camera is, as a creator, you wanna stand back and capture what's happening. You don't need to be in the action, you wanna capture it. So to see those two, uh, having fun is also good and, and that's rewarding because it comes out in good footage and good photos and uh, and yeah I had a blast down there with those guys really fun guys to hang out with I'm very lucky uh, so yes lots of work um, gosh I'm going to probably have to cut this one short because I've got so much editing I'm not paying attention to it but uh, everybody uh, just a live stream out of the blue I hope you're all awesome please be taking care of yourself um, uh Make sure you're eating right. Make sure you're exercising. I, I do know that exercising with friends or in a group is a lot easier. You've got the motivation there, especially when it's something that you enjoy doing. Uh, so hang in there, guys. Not long now. Uh, well, everyone in Australia, uh, you've done really well. People overseas, please take care, guys. And um, yeah, hopefully I'll uh, be able to live stream tomorrow. Peace out, everyone. Have a great week. Uh, thank you all again for your love and support. Uh, thank you uh, for all the work during uh, the, the current restrictions. It's been uh, phenomenal. So thank you all again. Peace out, everyone.